Hey guys, welcome back to a brand new video. And today I will be showing you some of my favorite cipher tripwires. So I'm going to start grinding YouTube. So if you want to see more videos like this to help you, make sure to subscribe and drop a like. It'd be really appreciated and it supports me. So let's get into it. So for a site, um, usually people are going to do that, but I don't really like that one. I think uh, that one right here is better. Uh, it's really harder to destroy it so uh, without getting hit by it now if you want to catch people off guard there's always that one right here uh, connected to the stairs um, and it'll people it'll catch people off guard uh, swinging for either heaven or tree uh, so that's pretty good if you want to play a bit further back on site uh, you can always place those two right here um, so that's really useful if you want to play heaven now, if you want to protect from default, so let's say you're playing B uh, and you want to know if people are going to play default A, that's going to protect. Now, there's always one here to door. Uh, the door closes right here, so it's protected and uh, it's pretty useful when your teammate plays tree to support them. And there's always that one right here. Uh, that's always pretty useful to know. And um, if you want to support your teammate's tree, it can always be useful. So what I'll usually do is uh, I'll place one right here and one uh, red to doors. So if my teammates are playing catwalk, uh, I'll place those two to support them and that's gonna help them a lot. Now moving on to B site, there's always that one, but that one's gonna get destroyed by razors or sobas in general. So uh, there's that one right here. Um, catch them if they swing heaven or if they wanna close the doors. Now for boat, uh, there's one right here. Uh, if they wanna plant, if they wanna close the doors from here, uh, it'll hit them and there's always one right here if they want to get control of CT come in here That'll hit them right here now in general I like placing one on this wall in general So let's see right here because I play a lot behind these boxes and it's a really really easy wall bang um, If they get hit by it, I can see them through the wall and it's a really easy wall bang same thing for that uh, tripwire boat here It's also a really easy wall bang. So that's pretty useful to know um, if they get hit by that one, uh, that's also really useful to know. It's a really easy wall bang, as you can see here. And there's no tripwires mid, like there's no really special tripwires mid that you don't know about. Uh, that one, I don't know. So I think that's pretty much it for ascent. So let's move on. Now moving on to split, uh, there's always that basic one. Uh, it'll get destroyed by sovas and raises in general. So uh, if it does, uh, there's always one right here. Uh, it'll catch people off guard if uh, they want to swing for uh, heaven. Uh, so that's a pretty funky one. These two tripwires, I like um, combining them with a cage. Uh, and I play screens in general. So if they get hit by it, I just do that. And then I can blast them. Now for sight, if you want to play for the back, there's one right here. Uh, if they want to go here. And there's one right in the corner here. Um when they get on site to plant, uh, those are pretty useful. Now moving on to heaven, if you wanna play behind this wall, what I'll usually do is I'll put one right here. Um, I really like this one cause this wall is really wall bangable. So if they get hit by that, uh, you can see them through, through the wall and it's an easy kill through the wall. Or you can still swing them, but I really like playing it safe and wall banging them. Uh, cause when you see them through the wall, it's an easy kill. But if you want to play further back, uh, you can place one right here. And you play, you can play here and wall bang them either through here, or you can swing them, or you can even play behind the boxes here. So those are pretty useful, and you also can wall bang this. Now moving on to B, there's always this one. Uh, I like combining this one with a one-way cage. Um, so let's say they get hit by that one, one-way cage. I can play back here. I see their feet, they don't see anything. I can blast them, easy kills. Uh, I already got an ace and pistol round with this. It's really OP. I love this uh, one-way cage and this strap. It's like one of my best combos. Um, don't worry, I'll be making videos on one-way cages with Cypher, so stay tuned for that. But if this strip wire always gets destroyed, uh, you can always put one right here, so if they want to peek you from behind. And you can also put one here to protect default uh, when they're coming to plant default. Sometimes I'll put one right here and I'll play behind these boxes because sometimes when they want to clear here, 
they're gonna go through this tripwire so if they do go through it you can either wall bang them pretty easy wall bang or you can swing them so it's pretty much an easy kill now for mid there's nothing special that you don't know uh i mean there's always those one uh for your teammates if you want to support them or if you even want to play here i really think you should play b instead of mid because cypher is really strong on b but those are pretty much all the tripwires for split and let's move on now moving on and bind a site um there's some also pretty good ones here that's a basic one uh might be getting destroyed by um raises and sovas but i like combining it uh with the one-way cage right here and sometimes I'll play behind these boxes or behind here. And when they get hit by it, boom. And then not the best one way cage, but it's still one way. It's like the only one way in the whole bind map. So at least you can see them if they get hit by the tripwire. And uh, that's a pretty good uh, tripwire. Now, if you want to play a short, uh, there's one right here, uh, which is pretty good. There's also this one right here. Uh, if, they, if they're coming here, um this will hit them there's also one right here um same thing if they want to come and swing heaven uh this will hit them so it's pretty much like two pretty good trap wires if you want to catch them off guard now it never hurts anybody if you just put one you all uh always gives you information on uh this this is really good to control you all so it can be really useful to have this now more on site there's always this one now, if you want to protect from default, just put one here. One here. You can actually do that. And uh, if they're coming to plant here, you can see them through the wall. And you can wall bang them. Now, moving on to B side. One of my favorite trip wires is actually right here. Um, what I really, really love about that one is when they get hit by it. Um, if and when they get hit by it they're actually going to be stuck in the air and won't be able to move and when that happens people don't know what to do because they're literally just trapped in the air and they don't know like they don't really have the reflex to break it as soon as possible they're just flying there and it's like, like it's so easy to kill them they're just like flying in the air if they don't have first uh first shot accuracy because they're in the air so it's like so easy to kill them now you can always protect default uh with these strip wires uh that's really good um if you want to get information if they're planting uh where and also obviously there's this one right here and i think that's pretty much it for uh the trip wires on split now for the last map on haven on the a site there's one right here um you can either wait for the barrier to drop or i think like the barrier is going to be right here so you can put it here and if you put it far enough uh you can actually put combine it uh with a one way and uh it's pretty useful to have both of them it's really easy kills and uh i think this is a pretty good chip wire now if you want to play uh here there's always that one but uh it'll probably get destroyed by sovas or raises so you can always put one further here um which is also useful now there's also one right here it's pretty weird but it actually works uh if they want to peek heaven from the left uh it'll catch them off guard and if you're playing heaven it can be like so much useful to know that they're peeking here uh trust me you'll want to use this now there's of course one right here uh to protect if they're going hell and taking control of ct so that one is pretty good now let's move on to B, uh, nothing much. That one probably got it get destroyed by raises or sovas. You can place them uh, right here to protect from default. Not the best. I mean, there's nothing really special that you probably don't know about. I mean, I think you, you know these, so there's nothing really to show on B. Now C, what I usually do is that I combine this one way you can just go in this corner and then just aim inside this and that's a really good one way and you just put a tripwire here you can play either behind the boxes either on top of this case or behind these boxes and once they get um once they get trapped by this one way and easy kill like so easy kills now if you want to play further back uh there's always one right here um so if they want to plant behind the box right here uh they'll hit them that one is also pretty good uh if you want to play off garage um you can play behind these boxes if you know they're pushing garage a lot uh you can play off these tripwires 
um, so that can be useful. But if you want to support your teammates garage, the barrier is usually right here, so you can put a trip wire right here. But also, if you want to support your teammates as much as possible, there's a one right here, um, and they're just gonna call it. You activate an easy one way if they're pushing garage, and that can help them a lot. There's always one right here um, if they want to push CT. That can be pretty useful. And this is pretty much it for the map Haven. Now, if you enjoyed the video, make sure to drop a like. It supports me so much and it gives me so much motivation. Like I said, I'm going to grind YouTube. So if you want more videos like this, make sure to subscribe. Um, you can always unsubscribe later. It's free, you know. You'll stay tuned for my next videos. So hope you guys have a good night or good night. And I'll see you later. Bye. Peace.